welcome to Top Stars World. Today we'll be doing a new topic, aka series, called Science from My Lenses. And I'm really excited to get into it with you guys. I've been waiting a long time for this, so let's get right in. Have you seen a comet falling from the sky? That's a good question, Top Star. I'm not in real life. I wish I have, but I've seen it in pictures and in science class. It's really amazing. It is. I haven't even seen a comment book from the sky yet. Whoa. That's, that's pretty cool, Toaster. Yes, and if you really want to know and understand what a comment is, you need to like and subscribe. And look, look at this comment. Does it look nice? It looks like blue and then green. It's just so wonder wonderful. It looks so beautiful. Do you have any other words to describe this comet, Mom? Pretty much, it's actually fantastic, I would say. And comets are frozen leftovers from the formation of the solar system from the cores of dust, rocks, and ice. That's what Saturn is made out of! That's right. Maybe when its rings got punched out and turned into comets and then went into our solar system. <laughs> At least comets funny. don't hurt anyone! That's a good thing. It's asteroids, which I'm going to be talking about in another video. Yeah, they need to stay tuned for that. Yes, and a comet can range from a few miles to tens of miles wide. As a comet orbits closer to the sun, they heat up and spew gases and dust into a blowing head that can be larger than a planet. A comet has four visible parts. Woo! What parts? You mean that they've got like different components? Or yes! The nucleus is the center of the comet's head. The nucleus is a few kilometers across and is surrounded by a diffuse bright region called the coma that may be a million kilometers in diameter. That's huge. <laughs> you can say that again. Okay, I guess we get the gist now. It's definitely pretty big. Yeah. The common, and the thing that like you said here for different sizes and stuff. Yeah. Like the coma is the nucleus envelope around the nucleus of the comet formed when the comet passes really close to the sun in a high elliptical orbit which is not a circle as the comet warms the parts of it sublimate and the coma generally is made out of ice and dust and melts when it gets close to the sun giving it part of its glow i know it's so pretty and then there's something called an ion tail which is made out of gas and Follows the comet, which is really cool. So is it like um and of and the other tail called the dust star, as you can obviously guess in its name, is made out of dust. It's made out of dust. Hmm. Did you know that the particles of dust coated with water, ice, and other molecules serve as a comet's building blocks and dust? Particles combine to form icy rocks that join together under the force of gravity, high speed collisions, and the result of a loosely bound collection of fused rock and ice. Wow. When a comet gets warm enough, it creates an extended dust rich cloud known as the coma around the group, which I've already explained. Okay, so that's when comets all come together. Yes. Isn't that really interesting? It definitely is. And I think we're going to explore even more of this when we go to the other topic. What's that one that we're going to be Asteroids. Uh, the coma contains a carbon nitrogen and carbon carbon bomb. Carbon carbon bomb? That's weird. The sun's ultraviolet lights will excite the neutrons. Maybe they have a party in there inside <laughs> it. That would be cool. <laughs> it causes them to emit a green glow, which is really beautiful. Absolutely. If your favorite color is red, not me, I like blue, then you're in luck! Because you would probably like to see a red comet, and there is something called a red comet. To have a red comet, the comet and its tail would have to be made of dust or flux or ions that emit red light. Okay. Furthermore, these substances cannot be overpowered by other substances giving out different colored light, so you can see red shooting stars or meteors. 
So if it reflects orange, it ruins the whole process. It has to be red. Red, red, and more red. Thank you for watching, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And hit that notification bell and share with your friends and family. Bye-bye.